Sorry if I was a little rattled at the clubhouse back there. Wasn't quite ready to see her face again, but... Same here. Even with what looks like a piercing gone wrong. Not great or anything, but good. Let it go, Selena. We had a moment a while ago. Oh, okay. Sorry, I forget I said anything. Now it's my turn. Why are you here? You're not really in bed with this pact. And what if I am? Maybe I need the money. Maybe I don't. Who knows? The world's a complicated place. You're better than that. You keep saying that. You're like a broken record. Can you two get a move on? Playing guard is getting pretty poor. Just another minute. We've got it under control, John. Fine. We've got a job to do, remember? Let's just see what this is all about. You think it might be a trap? Maybe. But we already made it past the line of security, so... Maybe not? Your certainty is assuring. Well, we can't open it anyway, so I guess we won't find out. Didn't Riddler carry one of these in Europe? He did, but they were purely aesthetic. No, I thought the USB port would up. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I was going to say USB I thought it'd be in that drawer, but it's right there. I didn't mean to look at it again. Here we go. Here we go. Decryptor detected. Accessing Sanctus Project Lotus files. Project Lotus. Sanctus. Retinal scan required. Shit. I haven't made the goggles yet. Retinal scan. Time out. The fastest protocol and method. The decryptor! You know what Sanctus is, don't you? I heard stories on jobs. Best I can piece together, their group up to... No good is generous. They're scary. Great. One thing's for sure. We're not getting any more info off that thing. Well, there's always Riddler's laptop. Harley still has it. The decryptor probably works with that as well. Everything okay down there? Send the lift back up. I should have come back sooner and reeled Riddler in, but I didn't. Knowing he was tangled up with Sanctus, and what he did to Lucius. This is my fault. My mess to clean up. By yourself? I can help. Why? Do I look like I need your help? You don't have the code to do what needs to be done here, Bruce. You want to do this your way? You'll have to beat me to it. This is why I hate you. What are you doing? Balancing the scales. You are not leaving here with that. Oh, honey. I'm already gone. Resourceful as 
as always. Oh, he's not gonna have children for a while. Bye, Bruce. It's been fun. You haven't gotten past me yet. Slow down a bit. You're coming out blurry. <laughs> Sorry, John. I forgot how skilled you are with your hands. Uh, just maybe did not have sex in season one. Watch out, John! <laughs> That's one way to get her to notice you. Move. <laughs> That's what they get for myself and I'm finishing this my way <clears throat> Harley's laptop huh you and I were going to talk somewhere else Oh yeah, did I get one too? Oh, Aww. Stuff. I want one. So, John, about the laptop. Um... You know, I'm the first guy who resort to stealing from anyone, anyone but her. But in a way, that almost makes it more enticing. But in another way, maybe I tell her, getting her good graces. Maybe I will. And maybe I'll do just that. Then she'd remember my name has an H in it. She always spells it J O N. Because we're friends, John. This is between us. Oh, we are friends. We are. But Harley's. Harley? I don't know, Bruce. I'm torn here. Just thinking about her makes me feel like I'm floating. She's the most intriguing creature ever to grace me with a demeaning insult. Which is great, don't, don't get me wrong. I, I, I want more, Bruce. Like you and Catwoman. I'm only a little ashamed to say that dance had my pulse pounding. What's your relationship with her? Your real one? How much to tell? She's just another criminal, John. She's only out for herself. Oh, you must be blind then, Bruce. I told you, I'm a watcher. And watching her, uh, she sees something in you. Uh, if only Harley saw me. Like, really saw me. The world's a crazy place, isn't it? I want Harley, and you want the laptop. Maybe we can come to an arrangement. I help you with Harley. <laughs> I see. You're up to bat then, Wayne. Up to what bat. Nice pun. To make that woman purr. How can I get that with Harley? How can I make her see me? People aren't as complex as you make them out to be. Harley's smart, but she's still human. She can be manipulated just like anyone else. Anyone, huh? 
how does one go about performing this magic trick? Find a problem they have, and then make sure they think you are the only one who can solve it. Once they have to rely on you, they're yours. Don't be a tepid entirely. She's animals, not. John. She's not gonna. Might as well exploit it. How do you know here. what makes them tick? Too bad you can't just open them up and take a look. You'd be surprised what people will say when you just let them talk. All you need to do is give them space, and the secrets will spill. Uh -huh. Act interesting. Let them keep digging. Fascinating. Acknowledge that you hear them, but don't get in their way. Yep, makes total sense. Nice try. <laughs> I've learned that manipulation can take on many forms. Some of them more subtle than others. Tell me more. Tell me everything. Get inside their head. Once you know how they think, you know what they want. And you use that. Just don't be a deaf for entirely, because she know, is not gonna... One of the doctors in art Unfortunately, she's not gonna get on with you. Wait, if you do that. I have an idea. Let's try it out. That That's mean. Now, first thing that comes to your head. What do you see? I don't think. A spider to me. Got to guide you. Mm hmm. It's a napkin with coffee stains on it. Stubborn. Just like me. That's what I said. But then I realized I wouldn't get any help from the doctor by being such a stick in the mud. You're an interesting case study, Mr. Wayne. I think you might be a danger to yourself and others. <laughs> Is what Dr. Leland would always say to me. <laughs> now, this one. What do you see? Looks like a ladder. Hmm. I can see that. The ladder doesn't care if you're going up or coming down. It just is. Kind of like the universe in general, right? So, what else are we to do but have some fun along the way? What an illuminating evening this has been, Bruce. I feel like we're on the verge of a breakthrough. Let's try just oh, shit. one. John, sorry, something just came up. Uh, it's business. I have to run. So soon? It's, it's fine. A for effort, Bruce. I guess I won't go tattling to Harley. So, will you help me get the laptop? Gosh, Bruce. We are friends, and you're right about that. And uh, we did have a good back and forth with the tests. I feel so much closer. <laughs> it's nice. Drive a hard bargain, mister. Wait. Jeez. <laughs> okay. Let me mull over the logistics. But I'm in. Meet me back at the subway when you're done with your business. And because we're pals, coffee's on my dime. Bruce? Please tell me John didn't see that and put two and two together. Oh, it's good you're here. The last time I fired this up, you didn't show. Had me concerned. What do you mean? The agency convoy? All those freaks were in one place and you decide not to show? No, I didn't like you. You don't take time off. So what kept you? I had business elsewhere. Well, it better have been pretty damn important. Had to notify a lot of families tonight. Too many. I was counting on you. I'm sorry. 
Since we took a big hit from those animals. I guess I can't really talk. We got there late. By then it was just Quinn. She still hospitalized a dozen good cops, then gave us a slip. Is that all? Uh, no. No, I... Uh, I got a favor to ask. Lucius Fox. I know he was your friend, and I don't mean to speak ill of the dead. But I think he might have been up to some shady stuff before Riddler's attack on Wayne Tower. He might not have been the man you thought. Not entirely. I knew Lucius Fox for years, Gordon. The man was a saint. On the surface, maybe. There's more to the story. Riddler targeted him for a reason. He didn't, Waller though. shut down any investigation he didn't target Lucius. surrounding his death. And that means something stinks in Denmark. He could follow that Not in Denmark, all the way and to Gotham. Fox's employer. Look, just how much do you really know about Bruce Wayne? I am him. I see where you're going with this, but you're on the wrong trail. Bruce Wayne is helping you. Uh, well, if he's helping us, he has a real funny way of doing it. At first, I thought Fox was at the center of it all. But there's a hell of a lot more. A Wayne Enterprises security guard comes to GCPD saying he was assaulted by Harley Quinn and her gang. And who was leading her around like a pet? Bruce Wayne. Then I checked the video recordings. Someone did an amateur job covering up the security footage. Files were replaced, time unaccounted for, sloppy. And strike three? One of my officers gets bashed in the head while he goes into Riddler's old workshop. Wayne even dropped my name with Bullock, like I'd back him up. <laughs> Dirtbag's got stones, I'll give him that. Bruce Wayne is dirty, and he's dangerous. Waller knows all of this happened, too, and she refuses to let me move on it. So I need you to bring him in. That's the favor. I can't do it, but you can. I can keep an eye on Bruce Wayne. Damn it, I'm not asking for an eye. I want him delivered, here, with a little bow. Gotham safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it. I know your friend Catwoman's in town. Got a rap sheet that'll put her away for life. Maybe I can't move on Bruce Wayne, but I can move on her. I should have done this a year ago. Dropping threads and walking away. You've hit a new low gym. Now, I'll learn to live with it. As soon as I get back to the office, I'm sending out a task force after her. And you, you better not tell her we're coming. It sounds like he's on a warpath. If I warn Selena and she gets away, Gordon and the police will blame me. But if I don't, I put her in danger. Don't forget that you're both after that laptop. Gordon might be your best chance to slow her down. Unfortunately, we're running out of time. I can't help but have sympathy for a man trying to do what is just. He feels as if Gotham is slipping out of control. And it is. You know, Miss Kyle is going to run sooner or later. It's her nature. How much can you really trust her as an ally? I can't. I know how you feel about her. She already betrayed me back at the workshop. Yes, Catwoman's motives will always be suspect. You know what must be done. 